Hey everybody, Kelly Ritchie here. Welcome to The Cutting Edge. Welcome to a new year, 2021. I don't know about you, but I'm glad to see 2020 hindsight in the rearview mirror. So I hope you had a great holiday and um, let's kick off a new year together with guitar in hand. How many people got any toys for Christmas? Um, any guitar gear? If so, please go to the forum and post what you got. Let's build an online community together. Let's learn from each other as well as from the materials in the classroom and from me. Now, I have some exciting news. Number one, I'm going to be doing a free Zoom call once a month, the second Wednesday of every month, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'll be posting a Zoom link. Calls will be recorded and the calls will be for free. Starting in February, I'm going to add a second tier and I will put the recorded version of those calls. So if you missed it, you can watch it. Or if there's something that you want to go back in and watch again, that will be there. Plus, I'm going to put a whole bunch of other really cool stuff in that tier. I'll talk more about that as we move into February for what's new then. From this point forward, every month, the second Wednesday of the month, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Zoom call. Bring your questions, gear, songs, whatever. And we'll be able to see each other, get to know each other, and build a community there. I think it'll be fun. Now, we are going to look at guitar gear this year. I really want that to be a focus. So here is a picture of my guitar rig. That can be very intimidating. If you're new to the guitar, gear can be very uh, mysterious. If you've been playing for a while, it can be very frustrating. I want us to look at what are the components to a pedal board that you really need to know about. Maybe it's just your guitar because it all starts here with the fingers, but what kind of amp do you want to play through? Do you want to play to an amp? Most people on this channel that are playing blues rock tend to be electric players. Often you'll see that I teach on the acoustic because I want to get just straight to the guitar and not get all hung up on a bunch of gear because as much as I love that, that can also be a stumbling block. So make sure that you focus on learning and let your gear enhance your playing, enhance your sound. Now I have a signature sound and a lot of that is built on my pedal board. So we'll talk about that. Now, uh, last year we spent a lot of time in the key of E. This year we're transitioning. We're gonna spend some time in the key of A. And last month I posted uh, a little mini series in the GoPro view section to where I introduced four new songs, three of which are in the song packs. All four of these songs are in my Blues Grit series on the True Fire side. So in this little mini series here in the GoPro view, I did shoot it down the neck of the guitar where I'm using my GoPro view. And this is shot on my iPad. I found that when I do put a GoPro here, you know, a lot of times I wanna be able to show just a little bit of a, of a, you know, a sweep in the view. This allows you to see what my right hand is doing as well as what my left hand is doing. But, you know, straight on, you can learn a lot about the left hand, even though this really enhances it. There's a lot that goes on with the right hand that you really can't see. So I have a three camera shoot set up now. So I've got this GoPro view. I've got a close up view of my hands and the straightforward view that you've been seeing. And let me turn on my guitar here real quick. So I will be using those when I teach anything that I add to any of the series here. So that will be helpful. So I'm excited about that. Now, um, the four songs that are in this little section, My Baby's Gone Crazy, Red House, uh, Tears Like Rain, and Crossroads. They've all really got a lot going on with the right hand, left and right hand muting techniques, so you'll learn an overview of those four songs, mainly rhythm wise, but I'm priming the pump to also look at lead. When we dive into lead, I wanna help you see that 
uh, there's not so much mystery to playing lead. If you can just get some core signature licks, you'll see as we learn these four songs, you'll see my playing in action and how there's a handful of licks that I'm using in all four songs. And you might not even notice that they're the same licks because they take on a different life form as you plug them into each of the different songs. But once you really see that, it's like, oh my God, you're doing the exact same thing here, here, and here. It's like, yeah. Um, it really comes down to those signature licks that we have and what we do with them. So that's really been helpful for students to see. Uh, but, but watch the GoPro view, all four of those songs. That'll get us started for the key of A. And then if you want to focus on one specific one, start with uh, My Baby's Gone Crazy because we're going to look at lead guitar next month to that song. All right. So to recap, what gear did you get? Please post that in the forum or just show off your pedal board, your guitar rig. All right. Number two, I'm adding a call the second Wednesday of every month, 8 p.m., Eastern Standard Time. It'll be via Zoom. I'll post a link so you'll get it. They'll be recorded. You'll be able to re-watch that this month for free. I'll start a new tier in February. We'll talk more about that moving into February. There's going to be a whole bunch of cool stuff there. Trying to make things available for people whatever level they're at. And then we're going to look at the key of A, our pedal boards, how it all weaves together. And uh, check out that GoPro view. Look at those four songs, do a deeper dive in My Baby's Gone Crazy if you like, and we will proceed into the new year together, guitar in hand, okay? All right, thank you so much for being here. Peace.